Hello and welcome back to the Technomancer. Alright. Start the repairs. No, nope, wrong person. I need you. Hi, Zach. You got anything to say? No, you don't. Hi, Zach. How are you? Hello, Amelia. Amelia. I'm fine, thanks. Why do I keep saying Amalia when I know it's Amelia? Great. Now that I've got everything, I can actually start on the repairs. But it's gonna take a day, at least. Fair enough. And once I start, I'm gonna be neck deep in it. So if you need me for anything else, I ain't gonna be available. Not a problem. I'm gonna go uh, have a kip. Works for me. Sure, you'll be able to get it working again soon enough. Damn straight. Even if you lost your legs, I could get you going again. Now get out and let me work. Have fun with it. Okay, she's unavailable, so put Scott into the party, I think. So, we've got to wait until she finishes the repairs, but we can go up here and just snooze until she does. Which also should give us a decent XP bonus for when she actually finishes that claw. Ah, the joys of shamelessly exploiting uh, rest systems. Actually, it's not really shamelessly exploiting. It's, you know, it's a... It's not a bug, it's a feature. Isn't that the old line? Rest until twilight. And rest until dawn. And she should be done by now. Fabuloso. If she tells me that uh, she's got some other part that she needs, yeah, I'm going to be mildly miffed. Especially if it requires going back to that bloody city. Take a look. Good as new. Like she's right off the factory floor. Okay. Good work. Great. So we can get anywhere we need to go? To the horizon and back if you need to. Excellent. Gained a bunch of XP. So we can go to the Hi, Lost Dome by Rova. Hello, Amelia. Okay, she has nothing to say. So I want to set up my team and Scott out. Amelia back in. Finish. Alright, so. Look at the old quest log. So. Go to the Lost Dome by Rova, which we are probably going to do now, I think. Yeah. Okay. Oh, up here, old dome. So do we need to interact with the rover? Okay. That's definitely over there on that panel. So. Or do we have to do the other job first, I wonder? Oh, it's all the way over here, right? Okay. Won't be able to come back from this destination until your mission is complete. That is fine. Let's head to the Lost Dome. I wonder how this dome will match up to the one in Ophir. The one in Ophir? That was your Technomancer hideout, right? I was always curious, but I wasn't allowed near it. Bit of confidential shit. Yes, it used to be some sort of museum. It was a fascinating place. It looks more like a pile of rocks to me. Uh, let's hope this other one is in better shape. Otherwise, that doohickey thingamajig you're looking for will be really hard to find. Yeah, no kidding. If the dome is really off the grid, then it could still be in good condition. But we should be ready for anything. The scavengers could have beat us to the punch and scrapped and sold it. How big is it? Should we be able to spot it from afar? I would Good bet question. On. If I understood correctly, there will be some small housing domes. But what we're interested in is the archives of these ancient inhabitants. Heritage. Mm. 
What a funny little... The offspring of those who built the dome probably reside in our cities. Or perhaps even one of us is a great, great, great... Yeah, yeah, yeah. Many here greats. we are, chasing after old ruins so we can rummage for answers on our ancestors. How remarkably absurd is it? We have the turmoil to thank for that. I find humans' curiosity towards the domes. Curious. Why do you pursue them in other artifacts with such zealotry? I don't want to be mean, Phobos, but as a mutant, you've become something else. Isn't it hard to keep revering something that brings back memories of those who used and exploited you? Mm. Yes, but no matter what happens, Earth is a forbidden fruit. And for that, we choose to forge ahead and not dawdle in the past. Fair enough. I can't wait to see it. I've never seen an intact colonial dome. There are only a few ruins in the canyon leading to Noctis, and they are in such a terrible state. Most are so badly destroyed that you'd need a pretty strong imagination to call them domes. Mm. I really hope they find something there. With Great Master Ian dead and our archives lost, it's pretty much our only hope of getting back in touch with Earth. Agreed. Man, this shit is the shit, you know? Open road and a view to boot. About damn time, too. I needed to stretch my tracks. Uh, you might be getting a little too close to your rover. Maybe you should give each other some space. Could be healthy for both of you. <laughs> Maybe you seem like someone who shouldn't judge someone else. Why do you want me to drive you out here? Trying to find a way to contact Earth. The same thing every Technomancer's looking for. Hmm. Think there's a way here? Really? Well, I don't know about that, but I like your optimism, if nothing else. So you hope to find traces in there? Clues on the next step to communicate with Earth? Incredible. It's definitely a long shot, but one worth taking. Agreed. If we find evidence of the scientific base of the Great Master's tablet mentioned, I think we can make contact with Earth. And if not me, another Technomancer someday will. <laughs> Even so, it's a dream. Equal parts fascinating and disturbing. <gasps> Do you really think they still want us? <gasps> Especially since... After all this time, they've never once made contact. True, uh, great. We got scavengers. We'll that bridge when we get there. Actually, they look to be fairly heavily armed for scavengers. Hi, Nisha. Either of you got anything interesting to say? No. Hi, Zach. How are you? Hello, Amelia. Oh, okay. We got some dudes here. And they're in the electrical resistant armor, which is going to make them tougher to take out. Aha! Level 23. Fabulous. No particularly interesting perks at this level, but... Uh I think that's the first time I've actually taken somebody down with a kick move. It's primarily meant to disrupt the enemy, not to uh, take him out. Good. Search him. ASC Soldier's Gators. Search this one. All components, electric. Ooh, electrical parts. Those are always very blah, blah. those are always very handy to have. Oops, that sentence comes out vaguely intelligible. So yeah, this is gonna be one of those classic go around in a circle to return to whence you know, return from whence you came kind of levels, isn't it? Uh so what do we think? Is fifty percent chance of resisting an attack that should knock you over? resistance to disruption from staff attacks. Yeah, not terribly useful there. So what do we think? Upgraded area attack, which I do use a lot. Upgraded dodge. Yeah, I'm going to go this way. Increase the area attack. Okay, 
better electrical resistance, slightly less physical resistance. Now I'm fine with them as is. Amelia, I'm assuming your strength's still... Yeah, your strength is still only three, which is a pity. Relationship status, good. So we don't have the plus one crafting, which is a pity, because that would actually get us rank three in crafting, and that would be very useful to have. Uh, hi guys. So, what are you guys doing here then? You know, apart from being pains in my ass. You can tell I watch too much American TV. Given that the correct pronunciation of that word is, of course, ass. You know, spelt with an R. You know, none of this American A double S business. Spelled A R S E, damn it. God damn it. It's the first time I've died in this recording session, actually. <laughs> but, um, yeah. And I'll be honest, yeah, personally, I've, I've always been more of a fan of posterior, is the term for uh, one's. Well. I was going to say is the term for one's posterior, but yeah, that, that's kind of bleeding obvious. Hit him. We can knock a couple of them off their feet. You've got to love the fact in uh, the cinematics they make it look like that armor's completely resistant to technomancy skills. So the question is, where the pissing hell did they get it? Because it's obviously not something common based on the way that uh, Ian reacted to it. You know, it implied it was something you'd never seen before. Need to do something about that get with a rifle. Down he goes, okay. Promising start. Okay. Let's see how you like this. And down you all go. Lovely. Decent. I'm picking up a few uh, useful bits and bobs here. Fortunately, this is beyond my skill level. Uh, having rank one lock picking has been occasionally useful. So. Dead guy. Very dead. Oh, bollocks. What the hell is that? To misquote Arnie, you are one ugly son of a bitch. Oh, stop staring at it and hit it. Definition of the word gorilla needs work. Get these damn bugs off of me. Oh good lord, it is a heavily mutated gorilla, isn't it? Jesus Christ. That's really horrible. Well done, game designers. Okay, 
and Nisha's getting the crap kicked out of her. Bloody hell. Draw field. Have that hurt it. Clear draw. You are really impressively ugly. But you're down. You better yield some uh, pretty good leather. Not even good quality leather, just regular leather. That's really disappointing. Still, at least the critter's down. Check out the inside of these boxes. Some weirdly dense shit. I'm thinking insulation? What the hell were the settlers doing with it? Good question. Locker here. Metal components. out the inside of these boxes. Some weirdly dead shit. I think an insulation? What the hell were the settlers doing with it? I'm assuming they have their reasons. Ooh, mask with targeting goggles. Engineer's coat. Got some good stuff in there. I'll hang on to the engineer's... Actually, it was the... In was it an engineer's coat we already have? Yes, boxes. thank you, I know. So they probably had their reasons. Ah, hell, it's another Technomancer I'm door. Glad you're here. Would have had a hell of a time opening that gate alone. Happy to help. Once we open it, though, I am going back to the rover. This dome's exciting, but you have enough company as it is. Fair enough. Yes, I want to uh, upgrade the master's gloves. Need more electrical parts for the damage upgrades. It's a pity. I could get tech four damage with that. Okay. If it's giving me traps and health pickups, there's probably another mini boss coming up. Possibly even a full-on boss. Oh, flame is marvelous. Is that uh, the asshole who screwed us over? Zachariah Rogue in yes, it is. Guess some rumors are true after all. Time to take out the trash. Kill them all. <laughs> Why the hell did he screw us all over? Apart from the fact he's an asshole. Yes, they've obviously technologically regressed a hell of a lot. Whoa, he hits like a bloody train. Gonna have to watch that. She's down. You are going down. Yeah, those guys you really do have to hit for the disrupting kick. Seriously, Alan, you barely even count as a Technomancer. You're terrible. And now you're the only one left. 
Oh, for the love of Christ. I can beat him. I can beat him. He just hits really hard, the little... Anywho. <laughs> Okay, take him out. We have a good zap. Take her out. Another health stim. Focus on this guy. So I think I might pick up that upgrade that improves Electric Fist to reduce the enemy's defences. That'll probably be worth doing. Have you noticed that uh, the animation sometimes forgets to uh, extend their staffs? And down he goes. There's one thing from abundance I don't miss. It's rats like him. Well, he's running for it. Another one to search. This tablet's obviously ancient, but the text's undecipherable. This will make for one hell of a translation job. Always fun. Great Master Ian's the only one who could have read it. Maybe Dandolo's heard of another technomancer who could, though. Patience. Something around here? No, that's... Pointless jog. Oh well, a bit of exercise never hurt anyone. Okay, that's probably a lie. There's probably loads of people who have been hit by cars while out for jogs and things like that. Ooh, first settler's gloves. They sound promising. Yeah, they're actually less good. Weirdly. Of the technological regression, you would expect anything used by the this is my skill by level. the first settlers to be uh, pretty good, but oh well. And down we hop. So Alan legged it. Wuss. because I was really hoping to get the chance to hit him repeatedly over the head with a stick some more. And head back to Noctis. Oh. Ooh. Still can't believe Alan was here. Talk about climbing the corporate ladder, right? Fucker's now the Alpha Technomancer of Abundance. Hmm. How can he vouch for Victor, the man who caused the death of our great master? I knew Alan was ambitious, but to that extent? That boy has always been an envious little deviant. I'm sure he was eager to. Do you remember how he pranked you back in school, like when? Scott, I'd rather keep my embarrassing childhood stories to myself. Oh, but it was him. Not. Don't feel ashamed. There will always be men who will sell out for phony rewards. Give him a medal, a pompous title, and he'll ask you where and when to turn in his mother. Mm. This infection of uncurbed greed happens even among mutants. Just look around. You've seen the pen. Some of the guardians are mutants themselves. True enough. And they can be the harshest of them all. 
disciplining for the sake of breaking in their batons. You taught your rival a lesson. Now we should know better than to run after you. If I know Alan, it'll only get worse. Yeah. At least we found some information, even if we can't read it. How's your ancient hieroglyphic, Zack? No, I can't. Nobody I know can, except Great Master Ian. It's a coded language that's nearly impossible to learn. Dandolo will find you a translator. Let's hope it's worth it, and not something boring like a soup recipe. I don't know. You should be relieved Never know when a good soup battle. recipe is going to come in handy. I can't imagine what the traitor would have done if he got his hands on it. He could read it himself. Let's go hand in that quest up here. I am definitely glad there's a ladder here so that I can get up and down quicker, rather than having to loop all the way around. Wouldn't surprise me if that was something that was added late, yeah, was added as a result of a testing process and people complained that they had to do a lot of running around and back and forth. Uh, so they're putting a ladder to uh, increase the speed. Or maybe they're just, you know, semi-competent level designers. I'm willing to accept that as a possibility as well. Zachariah, what can I do for you? They found some ancient documents. Looks like they date back to the settlers, but they're written in a language I can't read. And I thought you technomancers were so well versed in our old dialects. Mm. Maybe in Aurora. In abundance, we're soldiers first and last. We learned some colonial knowledge during training, but the languages are barely taught. The great master was the only one who had that Which is really short-sighted and foolish. So, now you need a technomancer from Aurora to translate. I might know of someone, a renegade of sorts who left Shadowlayer to become a hermit. Word was, though, your former comrades captured him. If he managed to hide what he was, he's probably a captive in one of their forced labor camps. Ah, marvelous. And getting to him won't be easy. Exactly. But if you want your document translated, you might just have to find a way. Thank you. Go to the rehabilitation camp. Sorry, rehabilitation camp. That's a euphemism if I've ever heard one. So yes, I'm deliberately saving the uh, you know, quest to attack the convoy until you know, later. And very later if I can manage it. Where the hell is the rest of my team? I don't know. Hi, Nisha. Either of you got anything worth saying? No. And... Hi, Zach. How are you? Hello, Amelia. No. Okay. Alrighty, then. You know what? That's probably a good point to I end this part. I think I know the camp yep. Dandolo mentioned to you. It sounds like their main camp, so I wouldn't be surprised if the man you're looking for is there. And I want to go with you have a few things to settle there. Fair enough. This is important to me, Zachariah. What they do to the prisoners there is inhuman. I just want to help as many as I can. You're not telling Fine me, by so, me. Are you? I was a prisoner there once. I can't tell you what they did to me. I'm just asking you. Take me with you. With pleasure. I get why you'd want to free him, but it also makes me nervous about letting you tag along. If we get there and you let your emotions run away with you, it's my life you're risking, too. You know me better than that. You've seen me keep my cool in the worst situations. Think about it all you want, but I'm the one who knows that camp by heart. Remember? It's going to be more dangerous for you to go in without me. Fair enough. I was planning to bring it along anyway, so... So, yeah, I think that's a very good point to end this part. So, I'll just... Ask for targeting goggles. That just looks creepy. I'm fine with my plus one to exploration. They're kind of red and funky, but they're uh, just not as powerful as my master's gloves, sadly. ASC Greaves. Do give them electrical resistance. But less defensive bonus. I'll have to see if I can... If I mod them with something on the knees, they might actually be viable. Land. 
you still not got uh, the additional plus one to strength? Because you're still only friendly with me, aren't you? Sorry, you're not friendly with me yet. Either way, that's a good point to end this part. So, thank you very much for watching, and I'll see you in the next.